speed up. Answer. Assume we run our program with p cores, one thread or process on each core. Then our parallel program will run p times faster than the serial program. If we call the serial runtime t serial and our parallel runtime t parallel, then t parallel equal to t serial by p. When this happens, we say that our parallel program has linear speed up. Therefore, speed up of a parallel program is given by s is equal to t serial by t parallel. Then linear speed up has s is equal to p, which is unusual. Furthermore, as p increases, we expect s to become a smaller and smaller fraction of the idle linear speed up p. List the steps in designing a parallel program. Answer. Partitioning. Divide the computation to be performed and the data operated on by the computation into small tasks. The focus here should be on identifying tasks that can be executed in parallel. Communication. Determine what communication needs to be carried out among the tasks that is identified in the previous step. Agglomeration or aggregation. Combine tasks and communications identified in the first step into larger tasks. For example, if task A must be executed before task B can be executed, it may make sense to aggregate them into a single composite task. Mapping. Assign the composite task identified in the previous step to process threads. This should be done so that composite tasks identified in the previous step to process threads. This should be done so that communication is minimized and each process or thread gets roughly the same amount of work. Define scalability. Answer. Suppose we run a parallel program with a fixed number of process or threads and a fixed input size and we obtain an efficiency E. Suppose we now increase the number of processes or threads that are used by the program if we can find a corresponding rate of increase in the problem size so that the program always has efficiency E then the program is scalable. A program is strongly scalable if the problem size can remain fixed and it's weakly scalable if the problem size needs to be increased at the same rate as the number of processes or threads. Please subscribe our channel for more videos and educational contents.